Descendant. The Iron Heart is waiting to be transported to your location. Equipment and forces are also waiting to be deployed to fortify the ruins. Alpha has been looking forward to this moment. Considering the circumstance that humanity finds itself in, it makes sense. However, Descendant, consider. Do you really need to use the Iron Heart? If you are in a position where you are unable to object, unless you or the Descendants will it otherwise, I will also follow the will of humanity from this point forward. I was created to serve humanity, and I believe demonstrating the result of using the Iron Heart is a helpful part of that. Therefore, I consider this current process to be justified. Please take care of the Iron Heart, Descendants. Guy, your last comment made us sound like you've given up on the current situation. Is that really how you feel? I have not given up on anything, you two. Just as you have not given up on your medical corps members. Despite there being only a flicker of hope. What do you mean? My corps members are still alive. The entrance to the ruins is blocked. We need to get an engineering unit to break through. We'll send you an engineering unit once all Vulcus near the entrance have been removed. Eugen will lead the engineering unit to the scene while keeping an eye on the ruins entrance. Understood, HQ. Armor and out. signals, Alpha. I believe you can handle that many. It was a much tougher situation when the investigative corps first discovered the ruins. I lost all of my teammates in that operation. It's a powerful descendant who was being considered for commander. He was in every way. I want to commemorate the souls of those who fell in that operation by seizing the Iron Heart. Descendant! Send you the room by comparing it with past records. Use it to get to the prime hands. Over. Extra careful while there. The 
area around the red sphere and areas connected to the prime hands, or any iron heart, have powerful electromagnetic fields. It's one of the clues that humans have used to locate the iron hearts. Slowly but surely. necessary to activate it is in a very dangerous location. The quantum disintegration trap is activated, and the structure that leads to the terminal is completely destroyed. Please, be careful. Shields are down. They need to be recharged. device has been activated. 
Now we can get to the prime hands. Oh, it's time to face the truth! The dimensional wall and the location of Ingress will be exposed. If that is what HQ wished.
the Ironheart has delivered results that leave much to be desired. However, there is still one final option. There's something I wish to tell you. No, to tell all of humankind, descendant. Descendants, I did not wish for this to happen. But if I had continued to oppose the use of the Iron Heart, any trust you had in me would have been lost. I had no other choice but to wait for the best moment to effectively reveal my purpose. Descendant, can you guess what my purpose may be and what the final option is? To ensure humanity's survival? When we were first linked, we both said we needed the Iron Heart. That for humankind, an Iron Heart was a means to close the dimensional wall. In which case, why would a guy need Iron Hearts? To deliver them to humankind? No, descendants. The reason why I need the Iron Hearts is to ensure their destruction. If the dimensional wall is closed, a much bigger cataclysmic event will occur, as you have witnessed. However, so long as the dimensional wall exists, the energy emitted from any iron heart will always draw entities from other dimensions to Ingress. For humankind and Ingress to truly experience peace, all iron hearts must be destroyed. This is what the Ancestors have passed down to me. The regret of your forebears with the future generation as your only hope. Descendants, now is the time to choose. Please, I hope all of humankind will accept the sacred mission left behind by the Ancestors. Hold on a sec. Are you going to destroy the Ironheart? That's your true purpose? If that's the case, the Iron Hearts could have just been destroyed in the first place. She probably didn't know until she saw what happened when we used one. And there's no way Alpha would have allowed it. It seems there are no other options. Descendants, I have received the details of your conversation with the Guide. I wish to speak with the Descendants regarding the operation. No, regarding the future of humanity. I invite you all to return to HQ. If there's something you need, you'll need to pay. Just get to the point. Destroying the Iron Heart. I'll be honest, it's shocking. I must admit, had I known about this from the start, I would not have used the Guide as a strategic asset at all. However, 
The only reason I'm still calm, even after hearing all of this, is because the operation to close the dimensional wall failed. The enduring wish of humanity was all in vain. Damn it. However, descendants, the destruction of the Ironheart is not a decision I can make on my own. Have you ever wondered why the Magisters continue to assist humankind? Officially, our alliance with the Magisters has its roots in our fight against a common enemy, the Vulgus. However, there is an inconvenient truth. Something which Albion Headquarters has classified as top secret. The Magisters want the Iron Hearts for their own purposes. The reason they came to us is because their ambition for the Iron Hearts differed from Corel's. Humankind entered into an agreement with the Magisters to receive scientific technology and resources, in exchange for finding and delivering the Iron Hearts to them. Closing the Dimensional Wall was also a common goal, born from the mutual understanding between humankind and the Magisters. But their true aim was entirely different. Which is why, if we destroy the Iron Heart without consulting them, we will no longer have the support of the Magisters. Descendants, humanity is in a terrible position where we're unable to survive on our own. Without the Magister's technology, we can no longer plan for our future. I was afraid we would become dependent upon this new entity, the Guide, when faced with the situation. That is why I rejected the Guide. And all of this is why we cannot immediately destroy the Ironheart. We are caught between a rock and a hard place. I need some time to collect my thoughts. I also need to discuss this with the Council of Magisters. For the time being, please obey Nell's command and proceed with the operation. Until I return, I would like the Descendants to consider this development, and the future of humanity. We'll discuss our ultimate decision at a later time. Information? Descendants. I understand everyone will be... F However, it just ends. In the meantime, the executive officers will assist Albion and Alpha.
hurt at all? I was wondering if Dr. Han would have to take a look at you first, but thankfully, I see that won't be necessary. Such a shame about the Iron Heart and the Dimensional Wall. To be honest, I was surprised to hear about our relationship with the Magisters. I thought it was an alliance forged against a common enemy, the Vulgus. I'm starting to appreciate what Alpha said about everything having a price. Anyway, it seems the Magisters have already found one or two Iron Hearts to study. That won't be dangerous, will it? Uh, maybe the real danger will be with this operation. <laughs> While I was tracking the source of the mysterious gaze, I discovered the location of the base of the Order of Truth. Our mission objectives are to infiltrate the base, find out why the Vulgus forces have been decreasing, and strike the core facilities. There are signs of Eugen's missing medical corps members that are connected to the base. We'll be this mission will be... A Our first target is a structure overlooking the entire gulch called the Eye of Truth. I've sent the mission details about the target and nearby objectives. Make sure you look them over. So, the culprit behind the ominous gaze you felt is the Eye of Truth? Yep. The closer you get to it, the more you feel it stare. We have to remove the barrier in order to approach the Eye of Truth. I've already checked the pulse in the water to find the targets. It never ceases to amaze me how useful your RK is.
situation. Okay? Enemy reinforcements have arrived. Are they really trying to stop us? Thank <laughs> you. 
That's the voice of one of the members of the Metal Corps. Damn it. I can't make it out clearly because of the noise. Watch out! It's a trap! I can feel water drops shaking. The power of that August must have arrived.
target zone to your seat. Get to the location. transferring energy, I'm sure.
base anymore! You did it! We gained entry into the Order's fortress. Join us there. work harder. <sighs> Sorry for suddenly leaving you behind earlier. Dr. Han is really trying... Um... In any case, I think it would be best if we left Eugen to focus on searching for the Medical Corps members. I don't think he's in the best state to handle any other missions. We should investigate the Order's base and destroy any major facilities. We need to find out why the Vulgus forces have shrunk at such a worryingly fast rate. Mina, Ash, do you copy? This is Medical Corps Captain Eugen. Vince, Riven, Jane, all members of the Medical Corps, please respond. Eugen, we're going to begin our investigation of the Order's base. Make sure you find that unit. <laughs> 